Hello everyone, this is Grimdown and uh, well since last time I actually played we made a bit of a level I think we've equipped a bit more items yeah we put uh, on the the, uh, the boots we actually got to level 11 actually 12 as well we invested uh, our physique and cunning points we've set up to, uh, our skill points we've um, I guess um, Fully set points into dual wield, dual blade. We'll see where we go from there. And uh, as we played along, we didn't really uncover that much of the map. I guess a bit. It would have been like this. We've made the rest. You're gonna have like your um, normal uh, serpent-like uh, sea creatures that you're going to encounter with magic or melee and uh, ranged magic ranged. Uh, some sort of uh, lizards type of uh, mobs some of them have uh, like uh, a more powerful mob between them that actually buffs uh, the other ones around and a lot of insects that's the basic part some dogs maybe and your average um, undead that's going to pop up now and then that's about it but we also found this it's a cave entrance so in uh, this would be uh, white mire that's how the piece of this land is actually called so over here is like the old dump most of uh, this part then you have um, uh, white mire white mire and i don't know uh, what it's actually called the other the other zone that's actually going to come probably also white mire i don't know we're going to see we'll uncover it let's see how this goes now let's go into the enter uh, into this uh, cave and see what's what I'm guessing this is just going to be like a random normal cave, but then again, I may be wrong, and this could be like a very interesting find of sorts. We we'll already have something of Jasper over here, whoever that is. I haven't uh, went inside, as you can tell. I'm just barely uncovering the map as it is. Ooh, more resistant mobs, level 13 as well. Not bad. Convict something. They are doing a bit of damage. Not so much, though. Poison is still uber overpowered we could actually make an entire build based on uh, this skill and a few uh, more than I have like inside my uh, inventory meaning this that I can actually set unfortunately you can like have them all because I don't know if you can put more than one on one item I don't think so actually let's check this out weapon okay if I prepare to actually set as you can see it goes red yep it does not let me actually set it so Whatever we put it here, and that's the bomb that we're using, the, po uh, the poison bomb, is going to stay put. We found a diary. Let's see what's about that. Ooh, we have ourselves a bit of a jewel. I have a lot of them actually made up. We have a poison emerald already done, a bristle fur, crackled uh, load, lo lo loaded stone, whatever that is, uh, chilled steel, rolling blood, and well, that's about it. Uh... I also we already have like a few mini clips made with uh, well to, to help you guys out to see at least um, so we've done like mini clips with um, um, low level parts of the game that you can actually farm out for some items and money and stuff like that also a hidden area which is also farmable um, and I've I think I have a clip on classes and something like that, uh, the basic uh, of the mold, so you actually have a clue about character class and what's uh, to be expected from you from the game, for the most part at least. Okay, so let's read this, this is actually better than we have, not really, it's actually bad, uh, better, <laughs> uh, not so good. Okay, let's uh, read up, we got a bunch of experience, you gotta love that. So, dirty covered note. Got uh, ourselves a bunch of idiot rovers wandering in our uh, hideout the other night. They were unarmed as they often are. Of course they tried to run away when we jumped them, but little good that did them. Now we have ourselves a few slave digging in the mine. We can't eat coal though, and our food supplies are starting to run out. <laughs> the rovers badly, uh, barely had a few scraps between them. With the bar which uh, bridge destroyed, we're stuck in this swamp. I'm beginning to wonder if perhaps we made a mistake by not following um, Cronley's gang to the west. Okay, so probably that's what we're going to encounter. 
may not be much uh, picking in the wilderness on the side on uh, that side of Devil's Crossing, but at least they had numbers. We'll probably hunt down a decent sized boar between uh, the lot of them out there, maybe. Hmm. We got nothing but uh, slit and the dead. <laughs> so I guess uh, happy dinner <laughs> or something like that. Well, we seem to have like an NPC over here. I'm thinking at least this seems to go a bit down. It's probably gonna give me a quest of swords. Ah, these are the rovers that are enslaved. I'm guessing a few of them seem to be dead. Nothing to actually uh, pick up. Let's see Jasper what he has to say. Please stay. A steer weapon, stranger. We're not outlaws. We were captured and put to work here in the mine. I hope you're uh, here to set us free. Your slaves here. Sorry to see, man. Nothing is worse to a rover than being uh, confined. We're part of a rover band that set up camp in a secluded part of the White Mire, uh, hoping to avoid trouble, but trouble found us anyway. Captured four of us, but young Larkin and two other men who were here already died from overwork. So the two corpses. They just left their bodies down here with us. Rovers follow the path of peace, but I can't help thinking. The world is a better place since uh, you set those outlaws to meet their judgment. Ah, so they don't like that I kill, I guess. Clans, whatever. I can get to Tefal's Crossing using a reef gate. I uh, kill the bandits, you're free to go. Let's get him to Devil's Crossing, I guess. A reef gate, curious. I thank you for your kind offer, but we should return to our people out in the swamp. That is our path. Very well. Here we go, a bit of... Uh, uh, experience and some reputation with the rover uh, faction apparently. Jasper, we will spread the word of your deed. Should you ever find yourself in the company of rovers, you will always find a uh, place beside our fire. Take care. Go. Goodbye. And see you about. Thank you again for something and he doesn't really want to leave because, well, he can't basically. Let's see. Oh, so this actually leads the other way around. Not bad. Okay, there we go. Bit of loot which we don't really need to use or can use. Because we have way better on my final room. Yeah, you take some poison. Oh, you died? You poor little bastards. Enslaving poor little bastards, actually. I'm really kind to them, you know. I wanted to get into Devil's Crossing and everything. And they refused me. Hmm, I guess they like their uh, people and stuff. Well, I would I'd probably do the same if I have, like, my own faction somewhere around and uh, I got, like, cat caught on something. And again, maybe they shouldn't be so picky. So we got a quest. That's uh, really nice. We actually resolved it as well. We got a bit of experience, some reputation. And well, we're about done. With this uh, cave. It was rather small. I was expecting a bit, uh, I guess, a bit bigger. Oh my god, our inventory is like nowhere near normal as, uh, I guess, placement. There we go. We've uh, cleaned it up a bit. Now, let's look at the map. Don't want to lose too much time. I guess I'm going to go through here, maybe. Hmm? Knows. And uh, see what's what. I'm going to go this way, probably. I guess we'll see how things go. We're really hacking at them. We have, like, no problem uh, uh, keeping our own with the mobs until now. And this uh, poison bomb is, like, well, to me, overpowered. I like it. Don't take me wrong. I don't want to, like, <laughs> I don't know. I don't want like anything change. Wow, we really killed a bunch of uh, these insects. I kind of hate these things. Then insects, I don't really like them as a mob, I guess, or monster, or whatever you want to call it. Uh, why? Well, I guess they're nice and all, but I don't know. I just don't. I'm not an insect lover myself. I don't uh, kill the occasional bug I find all over the place. I just let him be because he's alive as well. Yeah, I know. But, ooh, White Mire Rift, okay, now we're talking. So we seem to be close to White Mire, even closer than we're right now, because uh, that is the name of the place. Let's actually pass this way and resolve this part as well. There we go. We have your, ooh, there we go. They're taking a bit of, uh, well, actually, the poison bomb did most of the work. I kind of get to wonder if this is how it's going to continue to be. Why would we even get our e uh, class spells? There we go, have like two huge monsters we've 
pass them really easy. This should clean up the rest of them. Rather, there we go. He just got into the poison and he got dead. Gotta love that poison bomb. Really hate the music of the well the insect part, but oh well. There we go. He's like half health just as I reach it. More insects! Kill the insects. Hmm. Got tricked there for a minute. Give him a bit of poison, just so we'll be like on the safe set of things. Well, we can kill them anyways, we don't really need the poison bomb. They're not that tough yet, but they will get tougher and we're gonna need to change our gear accordingly. Also, we kinda maxed out on some, part, uh, some parts of the game, so it is to be expected that things will be sort of easier now and then. Most of the mobs. I mean, we have like uh, a 16 over here, this gives a lot of damage, believe me. This also is, was sitting rather good because we didn't spread out the, the points. And that's not necessarily something you need to do, just I guess my take on the game itself. Yeah, I can't care anymore, I know. We c oh, there we go, defense ability and poison acid resistance. I'm gonna go for it because they were like normal, now we have green and this is like the only remaining item that's normal on us. We had better, we found better, but I kind of wanted to have like, um, I don't know, a best armor yet, so I didn't really take the bonuses, which is kind of stupid if you get to think about it, because the bonuses are actually what differentiates, uh, in fact, actually does differentiate like anything, but an item would be actually better uh, if you look at the bonuses, then if you try to just get the best armor in the game. It depends on your gameplay, I guess. Ah, this is where the noise were coming, was coming from, that corpse. That poor little, I guess, uh, horsey. Or whatever, whatever is left of it. Let's uh, rift back uh, fast, uh, back to town. Uh, I kind of went in only to get the above... Uh, white items in my inventory, so I would spare a bit of time from coming back to town. But the, I guess the rift is really opening rather easy, so it's not really worth uh, not coming and selling because uh, money will be needed. I mean, I've, I've already seen my gameplay a few items that I really would have wanted. Some of them were like crazy good. This doesn't really do that much. Um, then they were green and they were for sale and I did not have enough iron. Really mean it, it was like 60,000 and something. What we could do right now though, and I kind of want to do this uh, just as we are in town. Uh, yeah, I'm kind of going with to Wedmire, but I'm not resolving the pump issue within town. I guess we'll see it in time. Uh, what I want actually to do is repair this. So it's going to take us like 6 scrap and 3000 iron bits. We have them. And we've just built them. I've restored this bridge, okay. I don't think it actually gives us anything. I don't know what level the mobs are uh, around this part. I'm guessing tough. I don't really want to engage them either. Shit, they're like 16. I'll go for them though. There we go. Problem resolved. Aha, this is huge experience actually. I'm really critting them even if they are like higher level. I don't want to take like anything. I was just, uh, I was just wanted to see what's around. To give them a bomb, to give them another bomb and problem done. Like level, level 18 and I'm actually handling them rather easy. There's like six levels in different, uh, different than uh, what we have. And like I said, I'm holding my own. Let's uh, poison them a bit. And now let's whack at them. Let's, if they're not going to crit us or anything, we should hold our own rather easy. Well, we got a bit of damage, but nevertheless. Yeah, let me see actually. Rather high level, not really. Normal stuff, I guess. A lot of cunning that they need. I'm not gonna continue this way. It is a possibility to actually grind the place up for the normal mobs. You're probably not going to get like any crazy items. 
but you will get a lot of experience. Uh, it should be like better experience than we what we have already. That should so be something. So Bourbon let you stay. Bah, man is far too trusting. You'll slip eventually. Don't be going far. My noose is lonely. Ah, I'm not gonna get into your noose, you dumbass. I'm gonna save your cracked skin. Should go down uh, is over here. So let me show you actually if we didn't really see this yet. Trapdoor should go down there. Uh, it's we have uh, one of the quests is down there. I guess helping out uh, to help him with the pump. We already helped one of the in the I guess in Devil's Crossing one of the NPCs will give us some experience. I don't know what actually that does. I don't really want to. Still waiting for one of my. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're waiting for something. Let me actually sell. We've got. Uh, how much are we? At? We're not getting that much money, but we're getting something. So I guess it's not really worth it going uh, that way. We'll see. So let's go back to the rift. Should be back in action. Here we go. We can take the gloves now. Yeah, I know, I'm, uh, I guess, I'm a loot crazy or look loot hungered or whatever you want to call me. A loot whore, I think that's the name. Yep. I'm not going to say no, it's true. I admit it. Wow, they, they die like just as they are hit. I mean, it's you can't get better than that, right? You only need to hit the, like the big ones. My God, we're killing even the big ones with the, the grenade thingy. I'm kind of really glad that uh, I took that one and actually said it. I didn't really want it at first. I said, "Well, why should I?" I mean, I kind of... Oh my God, we killed one of the elite ones like with just the bomb. going really well we're really getting a lot of experience to say the least uh, we didn't seem to actually go this way ah it's just going to close up the land I don't think we've uh, missed anything around here maybe a few bugs on and stuff been here already a bit of uh, Bug problem resolving, and I think it's going to get resolved just about now. There we go. These are a bit bigger and harder to kill. They unbuffed me. Something. This would have been like a good time to actually have the. It's called how it's called. What it is? It shadow strike. But we didn't really take it yet. We will take it, but further along uh, in our level. So I guess don't expect it too soon. Kinda want to invest as much as I can in um, in the um, I guess uh, night blade uh, level as a class. Go as close to 50 as 15 as uh, as we as I can, and then go about and look upon the class or oh, the other skills. We'll probably invest a bit more to get uh, to. Uh, to execution, I suppose. We'll see how things go. Okay, so this seems to be about it. We did get like a very nice, but it's a very slow, unfortunately, uh, crossbow. This would be nice money, but that's about it. Nice stun. 100% chance when hit by melee attacks. My god, that's like... Wow. <laughs> very. I I'm wondering if the skills actually work on the bosses. On the boss fights, at least that's what I'm actually, what I mean. Uh, we may have just missed the mob or two. Who knows? Who cares? We're doing like rather well. This is not level 12 zone, if I'm not wrong. This is somewhere around 10 tops. So we are a bit over leveled. Ah! There we go. Dissolving the place with a bit of poison. Ah, even more of them. Uh, 
Ah, and we're getting to a boss probably. We go. Apparently, we have a quest with that one. Should die by himself, but let's kill it anyways. And apparently, the rift is formed, and we can use it. There we go. We're sitting rather well. Unfortunately, we're kind of far into the episode. I kind of wanted to do more. I guess that we can make more videos. I don't know if you guys really enjoy this or not. I have like no feedback whatsoever. Right now on the channel, I think uh, we have like only two videos posted and uh, we're about at video six, if I'm not wrong. So we're kind of far out with the episodes. We'll post it uh, slowly or more at once in the bulk. I guess we'll see how things go. And uh, if you guys really like it, we really can continue. If not, well, we can change up and try something else. I'm just going to play it for myself. Okay, a bit of stuff. We always like a bit of stuff. This really seems to... Oh, we have some NPCs apparently. Something up ahead. Yeah, we found ourselves a camp. Roving dealer. Okay, so these are the rovers. Must be the dudes that we found it within the cave. And a quest. <laughs> How the quest would sound if we have some guys that disappeared. Can you take them? If he comes, he comes. You travel a dangerous path, stranger. This uh, solitary refuge is one of the few safe places left in the uh, White Mire. If you plan to set out on the road again, perhaps there is a way that we could help uh, one another. And what that might be. The slit are natural creatures and, po and poison the land uh, itself. So it seems only fitting that we should turn some of their wild magic against them. Uh, the shaman carry bone necklaces, uh, primitive things, but they carry primal power within them. I can wear this power into... I can weave this power into something more potent for you. If you bring me a few of the necklaces uh, and say a uh, hundred iron bits, with us in return, I will fashion for you a magic ring. What say you? You have a deal. And I'm pretty sure we only already have like uh, the silk necklaces. I don't know how many he actually needs. I guess that may pose as a problem. Let me see. This goes way much better like that. And there we go. We would sell just a few. So it needs like three necklaces and a iron iron bits. A hundred. And we have like enough. But um, as it is. Uh, ah, you've returned. Do you have the necklaces? Uh, will this suffice? Ooh, there we go. Hmm, rather nice. I guess we're gonna read it in a sec. Ah, yes, there is raw power in these bones and my uh, deft old hands will weave it into something more potent yet. I will uh, have the finished ring for you shortly. Okay, let's see the ring now. Slit primal ring. There is a lingering stench about this ring that won't wash out. Okay, that's not, not something you would put on your finger then. 10% damage to beast kin. Okay. And some energy regeneration per second. Increased energy regeneration by 8%, 10% elemental resistance. I guess it's not extraordinary comparing to what I already have, but it's pretty good. We've uh, made the quest. That's always good. We got a bit of experience and we lost some money. <laughs> It does to the which if you need uh, respite for your journey. Thank you. Okay, go away. Let's see what this one has to say for itself. You're the first to find us in the long while. You're welcome to warm yourself at our fire, but when you leave, I ask that you keep this place a secret. Sure, I can do that. As long as you don't bring your violence into this place, you are welcome to return. Any wisdom to share for the road ahead? I have to be on my way. Let's see the wisdom. The movement of rovers among the land of the settled... Uh, settled people are not always welcome and uh, so we learned many hidden pathways across this realm. If you are looking to get beyond the uh, uh, White Mare, the bridge to Burnwich village has been destroyed but beneath it there is an entrance to a flooded passage that can take you there. It would only travel uh, that path now in dire need as the cave uh, treacherous the cave Treacherous, even in better time, has become increasingly populated with slit 
and other monstrosities. An interesting tale. What else can you tell me about? Or tell me, old man. Okay. Apparently, he doesn't say anything. Many, even among our kin, have. Yeah. Under the truth of our name, Rover is an outsider name, confused for our true name, uh, Rohwari, the people of Rohan. Really? Um, yeah. Over time we've got so used to being called rovers, many among us have come to favor it. We've become a careless traveling free folk and lost sight of our first true path. What an interesting tale. Okay, so they're just going to repeat itself. Okay. Well, let's uh, sell our wares. I'm guessing it's going to be like the same price uh, as uh, in Devil's Crossing for its part. I don't really want this. Uh, it's good, but I'm not gonna go for it. This is pretty nice, but it's like 18,000. I don't have it in thousand. I'm somewhere around 13. Oh, actually, uh, 11,000. Iron bits. It's a very fast, so that's actually good. Oh well, I guess uh, we'll do it what we have. Let's see, armors, nothing of extraordinary interest. Then again. Ooh, I kind of like this one. Okay, it's only 1,000 and something. I guess we could just... Ah, we're, we're gonna go as it is and uh, I suppose we will find it in time, so... Not even going to look for uh, other stuff. Okay, close already. He really wants to talk with us, apparently. Yeah, I'm sure about that one. Let's go back. I also saw, actually saw one cell that wanted to come towards us. Let me help him a bit. I'm pretty sure he has friends. We'll help them too. We are nice like that. We want to help, you know. Be helpful in life. It's it's nice. We're gonna make a lot of friends too. Let's poison them a bit, and that's about it. We've really finished. So we're really far in the episode as it is. Uh, we're gonna end it up here. This one. If you enjoyed the clip, give it a big like. You're gonna see more. Subscribe, and I guess I'm gonna see you guys around.